Coach Finch said to his team during walkthrough today, you have to know your scout on these players and who's who. And Coach Chauncey Billups said to his team, this is your opportunity. You're being evaluated. Somewhat concerned about the lineups we're going to see on the court today. Marnie? No doubt. Got to do your research this afternoon. Anthony Edwards misses the first shot of the game. Post-ups by definition create sticky situations, right? Because Carl's holding the basketball in the low post. His aunt looks more like himself this afternoon. Beautiful left-hand finish for Edwards. Edwards tried to go to Gobert or to uh, Towns who cut the wrong way or the opposite way. Edwards looks at the three off the back of the rim. Feibel the rebound. Gobert was there, tapped it. And Carl Anthony Towns finally gets the rebound. Conley from the baseline, hit it. Talked in our pregame show about Mike and the way that he's been shooting. James mm. Sharp, oh my goodness. <laughs> the hammer came down, but so did the basketball. Edwards the other way with the left. Knocked out of bounds, it'll be Portland ball. It's an eight point lead at that time. If Mike makes that three, it's an 11 point game, but he misses it, it ignites the fast break and Minnesota ends up in a sequence. Edwards takes the handout from Gobert and then turns it over. Thibel has it, and it's Skylar Mays bringing the ball up the court. So, I mean, Chris Finch has been as, at this last time out, he puts Kyle Anderson back into the game, but against the zone, I mean, Kyle's been one of the biggest things that makes it go, and as Jaden McDaniels knocks down that layup. Drew Banks is a good basketball player. He's a nice complimentary backup center for them. Yusuf Nurkic obviously is really good. Anderson on the nice pass from Anthony Edwards. He just split a couple of defenders. Wildcats uniform and becomes the seventh pick of the draft. Edwards pushes it down the court. Jordan McLaughlin in the game. So is Torian Prince for Minnesota. And here's Towns. Draws the second defender. Finds Kyle Anderson. Who finds Anthony Edwards? Who finds the who? And there's that man again. John Butler Jr. takes the three. He's seven foot one. And we were watching him shoot a little bit before the game, Pete. That is a lanky man. Edwards fouled on the drive. We're gonna give him the hoop too. Shot. The ball movement's gotten better since Kyle's gotten back into the game. In Minnesota, it reflects because now they cut what was a seven point lead by Portland. Torian Prince has the rebound. Looked at Anderson for a moment, and now there's Shaq Harrison with the steal. Walker. Another miss, and the follow no good from Butler. Jonathan Williams is one of those guys. Played with the Utah Jazz in their G League teams. Ant tries to saloon door a couple defenders right there. It goes right through to the bar. One of two remaining home games in the regular season for the Timberwolves. Anthony Edwards, baseline, three-pointer rolls around and in. Anthony Edwards, Minnesota's leading scorer today with 12 points, gives it to McDaniels, and Jada McDaniels is perfect so far today. Release and follow through is... And the block! McDaniels gets the block ahead to Ant! For the finish, Anthony Edwards! Edwards. Oh, he just lulled the Portland Trailblazers to sleep on that shot. Anthony Edwards has been part of all seven points in this 7-0 Timberwolves run. Ooh. And there are three more. Thibel. Strong on that one. It was right on line. There's Towns to pick up the loose ball. Edwards nearly lost the dribble. Regains it. Goes up and over Watford. And it just wasn't, it wasn't pretty. So, I mean, in that game, Ant was 4-16. He played 38 minutes, Marty. Rudy Gobert has six rebounds. A lob too strong, though. Eubanks comes up with it. And now Watford defended by McDaniels. Edwards will take it top of the key over Sharp. Short cut. Sharp off the screen from Eubanks into the lane. Too strong. Edwards has numbers on the other end. Looks like uh -oh. everybody's okay. McDaniels and Eubanks just getting up now. Edwards, the pass to Gobert for the finish. Sharp off the screen from Eubanks into the lane. Too strong. Edwards has numbers on the other end. 
Looks like uh -oh. everybody's okay. McDaniels and Eubanks just getting up now. Edwards, the pass to Gobert for the finish. Look, I mean, I mean, Eubanks pulled, ripped that thing yeah. up, pulled it inside sure. out off his arm. Sure did. Towns offensive rebound, the behind the back pass, Edwards. The dunk attempt is deflected. Look, I mean, I mean, Eubanks pulled, ripped that thing yeah. up, pulled it inside sure. out off his arm. Sure did. Towns offensive rebound, the behind the back pass, Edwards. The dunk attempt is deflected. I know they ended up kind of going down in, in league standings, but at that time they were playing great. Edwards gets to the hole off the glass, Anthony Edwards. The Kevin Garnett's and Kobe Bryant's are, are great, but there were so many guys that came direct that kind of hurt their their careers, I think. Edwards blocked by Eubanks. And now Mays, the lob, knocks the finish. He's done a really nice job for a guy on a 10-day who's just coming to the mix and trying to figure things out. McDaniels lost it. Turnover, Minnesota. Turnover number 12 by the Timberwolves and Knox. Tried to finish that one, that couldn't make guy. it two in a row. N knocking that one away. Unreal. Slow-mo from the baseline. Kyle Anderson's first three-pointer of the afternoon. Edwards working against Sharp. Finds an opening. How about that from Anthony Edwards? Just sticking with it long enough to see some daylight. Back to a 10-point lead for the Timberwolves at the Knox mix. Let's see if the Wolves can build on this spin move from Edwards high off the glass. Gobert taps it around. Gobert taps it around. And Sharp is there to control it. No, and takes it away. Anthony Edwards with the steal in the bucket and laughing as he looks over at Chauncey Billups. Prince, the drive, the kick out, Edwards, baseline. Motions of Mike Connolly. Edwards. He'll take the three pointer. Working against Harrison, big height advantage for Gobert in that matchup. Edwards, the drive. Shot was deflected, no foul call. Edwards tried to get it to Gobert, but couldn't get it through the two defenders. Side. Rudy did a nice job of plugging the gap and then getting back to his own. Edwards, that was a fairly easy look. Jim, you said we haven't had many. The Timberwolves at least want seven or eight if they have to be in this play-in tournament. Gobert draws the double team and sets the feet, hits the three. Huge. Anthony Edwards, a huge three-pointer. Pass out by Rudy to make that decision. Now Edwards with the defense. Sharp can't get it. Edwards re Sharp can't get it. Edwards rebound. Great one-on-one -on -one defense by Ant that time, and then the support by Rudy. Those two guys making plays. The spin move. And so these last couple possessions now, Minnesota, the fans have got into the game. It's been one of the reasons why Portland's been able to play so easy, because 31 points for Anthony Edwards in front of this packed target center crowd. A lot of kids here today, too. A Sunday afternoon game. Gives it up to Edwards. Edwards guarded by Thibel. Three is off the rim. Edwards. And free and leading by two. And Sharp had a three in his sights. No. Edwards picks him up. He'll go right to the body. That's and great. lean in and draw the foul. Yeah, that's great. Edwards picks up the dribble. Conley gets it back to Edwards. And in the lane, left hand and one. A huge basket. Three for four at the line today. to a one. Carl Anthony Towns dribbles left, back to Anderson. They swing it around to Edwards. Anthony Edwards, right to the hole. And now a one-point game. And that's going to be it. Trailblazers have it. Knox. That's it. 107-105. The Trailblazers.